How do you manage that with the battery, you know? Usually battery is not flexible, so if you have to have a battery in there, yeah, how, do you, how are you going to position that? It's a smaller one. You could have two or three lithium batteries with flex. You've been waiting for longer now? Yeah. So this, this, this will allow you to, to bend and still have traditional technologies inside. Would you move into something different than a gallery instead? So it's, I understand that yeah, it's scrolling, and, and, and yeah, then you can actually... Exactly. And the exit, exit is, is always away from you. Yeah, we don't have the, the movement sensor in there. In the future we will have, of course, the touch screen. This, this prototype doesn't have it yet. Wow, that's and, amazing. And, yeah. yeah. It's, it's like a steering wheel in your car that you can really control uh, the speed and it keeps that same accuracy. Ah, here you go. Yeah. So you go into it and you... Yeah. And now I got it. This, that's, that's actually quite intuitive, yeah. yeah. And there, there are use cases where it's, it's more convenient to use normal touchscreen, but there are also use cases where this will add wow. the value. So. And definitely it would differentiate Nokia from the competitors, because it's a totally new kind of experience. But still, everybody are familiar with that because it still have a touch screen. You can play music, yeah. yeah. Am I gonna put the volume up? Yeah. There, you are doing that. No, twisting. Now it's full. You can. Now it's full? Ah, okay. Yeah. 